Good morning. Um, welcome now to day three of this sixth annual cholangiocarcinoma conference. And thank you, uh, thank you for being here bright and early. Thank you for those who are returning, and wel welcome to the to the new folks arriving today. So um, I think we all think it's been a very successful day one and day two. Um, one of our one of our key motivations for this meeting is to encourage um, discussion and uh, that might then lead to uh, further ideas and collaboration. And I certainly, I think we've had plenty of that in the last couple of days um, with very insightful uh, comments and questions at the microphone um, uh, that has stimulated uh, further discussion and further thinking about that. So please, today shouldn't be any, uh, any different than that. And um, for that reason, we're very keen on keeping to our, our time schedule so that we have those times for uh, discussion. So just like yesterday, today's um, uh, program is extremely exciting. We have a, a session on precision medicine because that is what we all want for people and our patients. Um, we have a session on liquid biopsy and liver plasticity. And then we're, we, uh, we have a se session after lunch that's all about uh, some experts talking about um, new, new clinical trial design and how maybe we can be a little bit more innovative uh, and, and study populations and get drugs to, um, to uh, registration faster. Um, and of, and then, the, then we move into a session on pathogenesis of cholangiocarcinoma, again, focusing in on, on um, uh, uh, the science and the evolution of cholangiocarcinoma. Today, like any other day, we start uh, and end with the perspective of uh, a patient or caregiver, which I think we all agree has been very riveting uh, and, and grounds us all. And I think it's one of the reasons um, we as clinicians uh, leave this meeting feeling uh, particularly uh, revitalized and charged and, and keen to work harder for this disease. So, um, is Hilary Saltzman here? Are you there? Okay, lovely. So, 